All right, when you're starting your animal face, you wanna use the white rough draft paper just to have a plan and make sure you're looking on your Chromebook at some type of picture of an animal. I'm using that one right there. So I'm just gonna sketch out first, kind of thinking of my artwork that I've already created and how I want my eyes to kind of fit on the page, where I want them to sit. Just kind of using simple shapes to start with. Then my mouth would be down there and then I might add some whiskers. Once I have a plan down, then I can start going, okay, I'm gonna start with my eyes. I'm gonna put that paper to the side. And my eye, I really wanna take up most of this paper. So this is like more of like an oval shape. If I wanted a little bit more cat, I can give it that shape. Just starting. I don't have to worry about anything on the inside. I'm just looking for the outside edge. If you're happy with that, then move on to the, the real paper. Real paper is gonna be on the supply table. It's a little thicker. So I'm gonna look at this and the actual drawing and see if I can replicate that. Remember, you're painting on this and we can also use the back. So I have that. Next step is I'm going to put another piece of paper under it and use scissors to cut that out. Now some people might want to paint first and then cut, or you can cut first. It's up to you. I just wanted to show you the cutting, how you can put two pieces together and cut at the same time. If you want to add a little bit of tape to that, you can. And then once you're done, we can start looking at paint colors and examples for that. And you can see, I'm going to end up with two. And if I need to make them smaller or bigger, I can always kind of redo it.